to so uniform across our policemen and other officers and men of the various city agencies in the various polling units, wards, and local government areas across the state. And in doing so, cards and other identified uh, stickers will be given out to all those that are indicted so that we can monitor, regulate, and deal appropriately and certainly for the, the deviants that we want to bypass all security protocols to do anything that we manage to I want to assure you that we are ever ready to ensure the peaceful conduct of the election in the district. We have both the air, water and ground components to secure districts. Equally, we are deploying to contain every situation that may arise. We are seizing this opportunity to warn individuals or group we may want to test our political will to communicate this onerous assignment of national importance. Therefore, any person or group of persons I want to go that line. We have to rethink because we are fully prepared to deal with that type of passing or group of passing without fear of failure. Equally, we want to call on good people of this state to be supportive to all security agencies in ensuring that this election is conducted under free, fear, and peaceful atmosphere. We are open to receiving information that will assist us in the discharge of this task. So any information that the general public see that will be documented to the peaceful condo election, please pass it through the dedicated lines or individual officers that are within your domain or even at the headquarters. Numbers that will be circulated through the various population offices and our control room, joint ops room, will be fully designated for the members of the public and other, including the media, to utilize in the course of their various monitoring and observatory uh, activities. Thank members of the press for aligning with us from the day and time we have been engaging in our planning processes and dishing out various directives and information to the general public and other relevant stakeholders. To this level where we are in the implementation stage and equally to see the full conduct of the election and through the level where we have post election review and then uh, the results announced and everybody can do his local businesses away from this and go back to the two office and continue to discharge our uh, mandates. The security for the elections are in two forms. One is for the legal security and two is for crime preventive actions. So while we are deployed, we are looking at both sides. So we cannot be carried out or carried away by the election security and we leave other aspects of the security mandate on our concern. So we we'll up and still do what is needful for us to ensure that for this state and the country by the station remain peaceful. Thank you very much. Employment and attention is quite 
can manufacture a green beam in all these areas. So you have nothing to go to solve yourself, the public have nothing to solve yourself. We have been this the first time that we have CPs at even the, the, uh, the other equipment at the area command level. In the previous elections, we have been having CPs at the territorial level, which covers the wider local government. Now we are there with either two or three local government, or some area commands have only one local government. That's the commissioner of police that controls the whole state, so it's popular. It's at the ground. Put that to the people, that you can receive their complaint and you can act immediately. We have deputy commissioner of police in a division that maybe you have CSV highest as the DPO. You are now having a GC, you are having an AC at that particular local government. That is a wonderful consideration and a wonderful way of ensuring peace and peaceful conduct of this election. The IG has not lost any sleep to ensuring that this election is peaceful. And we're here to ensure that that situation and that uh, action is taken to the letter to ensure that we have a peaceful conduct of election in this state. So, well, we are, we really want to talk to you. you know, uh, if nothing happens, nothing happens. Or if something happens, you know. Why we are making all these efforts? That's why I took time to also call on the people of this state and other political stakeholders to cooperate with us. I expected also that the media, as we usually do, to continue to re echo, particularly on politicians that don't follow the rules of the game. I want to go extra mile to create a situation that will affect their own people. So the sensitization you only go to those sponsors of thoughts and sponsors of all those that uh, are being used to create situations, negative situations in the course of uh, electoral processes. So you help us with that. Also that for now to the day of the election so that you understand all these ills and the, of the actions that will be able to affect the full political election. We were resolute, our focus on our mandate I will make sure that this election is free, fair, and credible, as well as peaceful. Thank you.